So I went to the eye doctor the other day for the very first time, probably maybe even forever. I don't even know if I went as a young kid uh, because I've never ever had issues with my eyes. And uh, lately, I have been. Yeah, stuff that's kind of in the near range, I guess. And that's that's a little concerning, but I but I am getting older, and that kind of happens. So, anyways, I went to the eye doctor, and she was like, "Yeah, your vision from like here back, 2020, super good, no worries." But close, we definitely there's there's definitely something there, a little fuzzy. And I was like, "Yeah, I know." So, um, we got a prescription. Now, I haven't gone and filled the prescription yet. I have to go do that. My wife's getting her eyes tested, and my daughter is. So, we figured once we figure out what's all going on, we can all go together and make it a little family family ordeal. But, um, when I was there, I was actually talking to my eye doctor uh, about blue light glasses. And because, you know, you go online and you hear all of this you know, oh, I love it, I love it, oh, I know it's useless, it's people talk, whatever, right? It's... So I asked her about it, and she was like, um, so it's a weird topic in regards to eye, your eye health. Um, she goes, it's hard to say there's no scientific proof in a lot of aspects in regards to if it's beneficial or not having blue light glasses. But she said she wears them when she's in front of a computer or for long periods of time. And she, she finds them beneficial. Uh, and on my prescription, she actually put on them to put uh, blue light into the prescription. So it would be actually in the lenses. So I, I'm kind of leaning toward maybe it does do something. As well as she said that a lot of people get headaches in that. And it's not necessarily because of maybe the computer screen, but just the blue light in general, because blue light can uh, hinder your ability to kind of rest. So, you know, it's, we see that a lot of times with people that use their phones in that at night before they go to bed, they have problems sleeping. Well, could be the blue light. Now, I'm not a doctor or anything. I'm just, this is what I was told, et cetera, et cetera. And it's funny because we had this conversation and then literally that afternoon, I got an email from these guys, uh, Spy, Spy Optics. Yeah, right here, Spy Optics. And they're like, hey, we have some blue light gaming glasses. And I was like, that's awesome. Uh, do you have just normal blue light glasses for those of us that are looking at a computer all, all day? She's like, yeah. I, th I say she, but she, he, I don't, doesn't matter. Uh, and I'm like, can I try those? And they were like, yeah, for sure. We'll send you a pair of those. Uh, and they have this uh, happy, so they call it this uh, happy lens tech. So um, I'll put links first to this website uh, so that you can watch this video to get an understanding of how it works. And we got a pair of blue light glasses from them, which uh, I'm excited to wear, especially up until I get my other glasses. And uh, I asked if uh, they had a pair of sunglasses that I could try because I love the sunglasses. And they said, yeah, pick, up, pick out a pair. And I was like, okay. So I, I picked out a pair. So we'll, we'll try those on just to see. And uh, we'll do that right now. Um, so anyways, here here it is, right? It talks about the sun gives out all kinds of rays, which a lot of us know. We, we know that, right? But it says good and bad for your health and well-being. And a lot of, I want to say more inexpensive blue light glasses, which I've used in the past for sure, because they're inexpensive. Um, basically, it's just a, like a, a coating on the top, uh, which, which just blocks out all that color range just <laughs> completely. But it also means that any of the good rays that need to come through, which can help with like, what it says here, uh, that can help boost your mood, alertness, and optimize color are also taken away. Which for, for me, especially sitting in front of a computer doing video editing and color correcting, 
that becomes an issue. And I do know that a lot of times when I was in the color correcting phase of editing, I would take my blue light, Blu-ray glasses, blue light glasses off because I, I just, they didn't seem as clear. And these are here, you can see it, it's showing you a little bit of a, this is what the other guys, this is what, and I actually, just so you guys know, I tried these on last night just to see in front of the TV. I was like, oh yeah, that's nice and clear. So uh, again, I'll put links to this if you guys want to go look at more information about it. Uh, and they have all kinds of stuff, sunglasses, ski goggles, eyeglasses, there's your blue light glasses. They have ones for gaming. Uh, so if you're a gamer and sit in front of a computer screen all the time, there might be something of interest. Here's the happy screen, which is what I got. Bunch of different designs here, depending on your looks. Uh, I think I went with these ones, the uh, Crossway Happy. I was just like, hey, they're clear, that'll be kind of cool. And I got a pair of just normal sunglasses. So I think, again, I'm just gonna have to ponder which ones they were. They have so many, so many glasses that you can kind of choose from. Anyways, you'll see them, you'll see them down here. You guys will get an idea. Uh, but on, on a side note, I will have to get a prescription filled. And I was kind of excited to see that they actually have eyeglasses which means you can actually get uh, frames from them to for your prescription. Yeah, so I, I, I may look into that as well. Okay, so here they are, two different ones. And I think, I think these, these ones here are the, the, the happies. Yeah, yeah, what do they, I keep calling them happy something. Happy, happy, they're the happy screens, right? So for screens, so happy lens tech, right? So. Comes in a little case, which is cool. Comes with a little, just a little sticky thing, yeah. So you get a little happy screen for better focus and protection, which is nice. Reduces eye strain and fatigue. Patent tech tuned to boost mood and focus. Supports healthy sleep. Yeah, Spy Plus, a little sticker. Nice, and I'm guessing Oh, this is like your registration and how to clean them and lens changing, et cetera, et cetera. I do like that. Uh, maybe not all their glasses, but some of them and their goggles, you, you can get replacement glasses, which, which, I, which I find quite nice. Um, and I usually wear, I don't want to say expensive glasses, but not cheap glasses normally, at least for sunglasses. Uh, so... These, these I'm excited to try. So this is how they come, and it's just, it's, a, it's, a, it's just a bag of goodness, right? And there's your little carry case slash cleaning cloth. So we'll just take those off. And again, I got the clear. So Spy, yeah, it says right there. You guys may be able to see that. Spy Crossway. You may not be able to, right there. Crossway. Crossway, yep. Clear with a little blue little Spy Cross on the side. Says it on there, happy, happy screens. And you can even see like when you look in there, there's a little bit, maybe you guys can see that. There's, like, there's a little bit of that blue in there. You see it? Uh, and a little, a little, maybe a little bit of a color shift. I'm not too sure. But really I'm gonna put them on because normally I try the cheap ones. And these aren't like crazy expensive, 90 bucks. That's not bad, right? If it's gonna help you sleep and be attentive and stuff like that. You you have to get used to this because I might be wearing glasses more often. So here it comes. Ready? I've got a sticker, but you can almost see that there's a little tint. And the other thing that I find too with the cheaper ones that I've used that I've in the past, um, especially when I'm dealing with light and and the computer monitor, especially, I would always get these weird almost reflections in my glass where it was like. I don't know, the light was hitting on the side and you'd get this like, almost like uh, a flare or something that would happen and you'd always be like, what? But yeah, see these, there's a there's almost like a, it's really minute, but it's almost like a really, really, really light tint inside them. It seems to 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 kind of give you that little bit of crisp, crispness. But I'll be, I'll be wearing these for sure for the next little while. Uh, and because the other ones are, prescription-y, depending on what I'm doing. Because when I'm working on a computer, for instance, my focus, my issue, they said, was in about, 
you know, like arms reach, like that I can see okay, I'm fine. Here I have issues. So there's a real here and kind of closer. But when I'm working on a computer screen, for instance, um, my, my computer's over an arm's reach away, usually. I don't, I don't sit that close to a computer. So these will probably be better because there's no prescription in them so I can continue to wear these. Now, when I'm reading or I want to get up close, I can switch to the other ones. But what do you guys think of these? Again, let's take, I'll take this, this sticker off. Does the sticker come off easy? Yes, it does. A little bit of, little bit of smudge on it, but not too bad. And there's a little, it's almost like a little, two little people up in the corner. Love and life. Yep. What do you think? Yes? No? Yes? I like them. It's clear. It's good. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll be starting to wear these today while I'm editing. Over there. Next video coming up over there, whenever that comes out, you'll, you'll see me wearing them. Yep. And just so you guys can see, because maybe you're like, well, I like that. I like the quality of the glasses and I, I don't necessarily want to spend an enormous amount. Now, watch with their sunglasses. Just so you guys are aware. I'm just going to bring them up here, right? If you come into new glasses, for instance, here, they're not, I don't want to say they're not inexpensive. Okay. So if we came in here polarized, right? $150, you know, these ones are $100, $145. I think these ones here were about $160. Yeah, these are the ones I got right here. Actually, this one, Discord, the gray right here. So $160, and I believe that's US. So definitely not inexpensive, but you know what? If you're protecting your eyes, I'm all about, it's okay to spend more money, right? I think that's probably why my eyes have lasted maybe as long as they have. It's because I always try to wear the quality glass in front of them. Sticker, again, if you want to do some advertising for them, right, you can. Uh, you get the little happy, see better, feel better. Yep, I'm, I'm down with that. And again, you get a little same kind of deal that came with the other one. Yes, yes. But these ones come in a little hard case, which I like. Because they probably realize these are going to be out and about more often. You're going to take them with you. Whereas your screen glasses probably just sit in front of your computer screen, right? Unless you're taking them to work and back, then hard case would be nice. So same deal. You get a little, little soft case, which is nice if you want to bring that. And then these. Okay, dokey. Arms, arms. I always like getting them like, I always used to get just black black glasses, but now I, I don't want just black. I, I say that and I'll probably end up getting black prescription glasses, but these ones remind me very much like of a, almost like an Oakley style glasses, which is what I normally wear. But uh, these, these are like, and again, see, happy lens polarized spy discord. Yeah, still they got the happy, still got the happy in there, which is excellent. And they're, I don't want to say they're heavy, but they are, they, they're they solid. Let's let's say that, they're solid. These are really nice solid glasses for sure. Um, you guys get an idea. And again, these have, I guess, the, the happy tech inside them. And you will see, like when I look at my screen uh, here, my, my Mac screen, you can tell that you are getting a lot more of that blue pulled away. Um, and, and these ones, not that you would normally be wearing sunglasses while you're editing, but you can get, the blue is gone for sure. Uh, and, and that that's gonna help your eyes just relax. You know, relax. All right, my friends, these are the Spy, Spy Optics? Spy Optics. And they're the they're ones with the happy tech inside them. Uh, you, you will probably, probably most likely see me wearing these uh, in outdoor videos and of course videos that I shoot over in the other room where we do some tech stuff uh, And uh, yeah, I like I like these I may I may I may look I was looking at I'll show you which ones I was looking at eyeglasses ready uh, I was looking at let's see if I can find them These ones I think I think it was these ones. I was looking at uh, the Vons these ones here 
I thought, oh, those are kind of cool. But again, buying online, yeah. it's hard, right? You're like, I, what, what do they look like in real life? Because I kind of, I was kind of digging those. Got a black but with clear arms, right? Vaughn 54s. Oh, maybe. I'm hoping somebody has them like physically in stock so that I can go take a look and try them out because, oh, no, these are the ones. Hail 56. These are the ones that I was like, oh, these are cool right there. That's them. Hail 56, 195 bucks US. Not bad. All right, guys, leave comments below what you think of these glasses, what you think of blue light glasses, and what you think of these Hail 56 glasses, right? Be just a frames. So, yeah. All right, guys, uh, links down below to Spy Optic. Uh, and it's cool too, because if, if you're on their website, they actually have a like here, shop locally in Halifax. So they tell me where I can go to kind of look at these to see what they have physically in stock, right? And these will be probably their ski goggles and sunglasses. But still, very cool. All right, guys, uh, links down below if you're interested uh, or want to just get more information. And uh, that's it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, do all the cool stuff. Hit that little notification bell because it definitely helps support our channel. And we will see you fine folks uh, tomorrow. Later.